SMT Nation, we are back. Nation, I didn't see this coming, but apparently uh, Charter, Spectrum, if you guys have heard of the company, you probably have. They may service your area with home broadband. They are uh, becoming quite the competitor in a lot of different ways. Uh, they're doing so with TV. They're doing so with home broadband. They're doing so with wireless. They're, they're doing it all. I have to admit, they are getting very active. And they're doing some customer or consumer-friendly things. I just didn't expect to see it. Uh, so we're going to talk about why they're doing this and what caused it. But first, let's just talk about the deals. I don't know if this has gone live yet by the time you're watching this. If it hasn't, it's coming soon, probably within the next 24 hours. So be on the lookout for it. But I'll be sure to link the press release here as kind of the placeholder for this news and these updates from Spectrum. Link in the description. Waste to support us can be found there as well. Please do like and share this video. Subscribe if you're new here and turn on the bell notifications icon to never miss an upload from the SMT. All right, folks. So here is the business. First things first, Spectrum is going to be moving to a new pricing model. They're going to start doing taxes and fees included on all services. And what they're going to be doing specifically is rounding everything to the whole dollar. So no more of that you know, $39.99 business plus tax and fees, and it takes you to $46, $38 or whatever, right? They're just going to give you a round number. All the tax and fees will be worked into the billing. Okay, so obviously as customers, we love it. It's great. Upfront pricing is the best. And now all that is built in. And I think that's a smart move. That's what T-Mobile has always been known for. And it's, it's endeared them to the consumer. This is smart. I didn't think Spectrum would have been the one to do this, but apparently they were. So shout outs to them. Not innovative, but innovative for cable, for sure. All right, next thing. Uh, Premier service, the internet service, $30 a month. In fact, when I'm looking at the construct of this deal, uh, what they're doing is uh, it's going to be locked in at a three-year price guarantee, which I think exceeds the typical term for Spectrum. I don't know if they typically do one year or two years, but I think three years goes beyond. That's more akin to what you see from like the wireless telcos. So that, that kind of lines them up or gets them in the same arena in that respect. There are some terms that you got to know. I know that, um, you know, you got to bundle it with mobile and TV. So they, they want you sticky, right? They want you having multiple services with them, doing business on a, several levels with them. So if you can meet the terms of that, then you could take advantage of it. So uh, look into bundling to get that pricing discount. The internet deal itself is for 500 meg service. If you want to upgrade to the gig service, it'll cost you 40 bucks. Okay, so that is definitely confirmed and that is coming. Uh, in fact, if you're real serious about the service, they're doing uh, same day service appointments if you call by 5 p.m. So technicians are ready to kind of handle that business. They're actually, they're doing full day credits for outages, right? So I'm guessing what they do is they prorate the bill through those bill credits if the outage is longer than two hours. So if it's longer than two hours, they're backing up their, their service reliability with that. So I, I don't think there's any contracts involved. They'll price lock you if you want it, you know, that type of thing. Uh, they're doing speed boost right now. Anybody who's on a 300 meg plan moves to 400. Anyone on the 500 goes to 600. You're getting a boost, right? So no additional cost, lots of extra speed if you need it. Uh, of course, it's welcome since it's no, uh, no extra cost. And this is on top of everything they're doing with wireless with respect to iPhone deals and switching deals and getting you to come over to their side. I'm, I'm very, very pleasantly surprised to see Spectrum getting aggressive. So why? Why is Spectrum so aggressive? Why are they getting so involved with these deals? What's going on here? Well, it's very simple, folks. Fixed wireless access has been kicking their ass. Like, let's call a spade a spade here. You know, you got T-Mobile Home Internet taking their customers. You have Verizon Home Internet also taking their customers. You have AT&T Internet Air now involved in some occasions, in some locations. That's a lot of business to take. Charter has been losing customers. They are net negative for several quarters consecutively. And they're still building out their network. They're getting larger. They're going to rural areas with B dollars. And they're upgrading their network with Doxis. And, and you can't sink money into your network and have all this CapEx and you're losing your customer base. It just can't happen. I think Charter is smart. I think this is very wise. I don't know what took them so long, <laughs> but I'm really glad that they finally come around to this. They got sick and tired of losing customers. 
you know, investors are going to look for customers to be added profitable, uh, in very profitable ways. And I think the way Spectrum will do it is by deepening the customer relationship, making sure they're sticky, making sure they don't churn, keeping them on and getting them with multiple services. So shout out to T-Mobile Home Internet. Shout out to Verizon Home Internet, AT&T. It's the competition that has caused cable to finally move and change their ways. And finally, humbling themselves and understanding that the way they were doing business before is not something they can continue to do moving forward or else you get your ass handed to you due to Verizon, T-Mobile, and AT&T a little bit to a lesser extent. But now they're more competitive. I'm happy to see it. I'm glad they're doing it. It's good for us, the consumer. It's actually still good for their company too because they were losing money and they were losing customers. And now they're being more competitive. They can get customers back. Very, very smart, very wise. And look out for these deals. If you're interested, check them out. They should be live very soon. But tell me what you guys think about all this. Sound off in the comment section below. You're the voice of the people, the SMT Nation. Let your voice be heard.